welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to make a box for my sister's yard in jewelry. We're going to use purple mica powder and pink mica powder and seashell mica powder. And who are the powders by? Let's resin. Let's resin. And what's this one? Uh, this is chameleon powder. Yeah. That's got pink and purple. Yeah. And that's a nail powder. Yeah. Right, so this is the mould. Yep. This is the lid. Yep. And this is the... Uh, base. Base. And these are... Who is this from? Uh, Nicole. Be Buan Nicole. Right, these are candle moulds. Yeah. And eco pole moulds by Buan Nicole. They snap together when you. Pull They're magnetic, them. aren't they? Yeah. And when you put it back, it makes a noise. <laughs> right, so we're going to put that to one side. Yep. Right, so tell everybody about eco pole. Show in the bag. It's. Show people the bag, darling. You have to show them what you're using. So this is eco pole. So you look, you have yeah. to do it like that. This is eco pole. It's Liverpool Friendly Casting Powder. Mm. Just for you on line UK. Good boy. And um, it's eco friendly. What else is it? Safe for kids. Yeah. We'll say it then. You have to say Safe it all. Safe for kids. And go, a go, uh, just a great resin alternative, remember? Right. Yeah. So what's the ratio for your couple? You need 100 of powder and 30 of water. 30 grams of water. Yeah. So the ratio is a 10 to 3. So for every 10 grams of powder, you need 3 grams of water. So for example, as Alessio said, for every 100 grams of powder, you'll need 30 grams of water. So what we're going to do is we're going to get him um, his scales and his bowl and then yep. we're going to weigh out some of the product. That. That's to turn it on, isn't it? And then we need to put your bowl yeah. on top of there. So what's it saying there? Um. 127 grams. So we need to press the reset button to take it mm. back to zero so it doesn't calculate the weight of the... Yeah. The bowl. powder. Bowl. And powder. Bowl. We're, mm. we're calculating. We're, we're weighing the powder. Yeah. So this is um, a kilo bag. Yeah. Of the Just Few Online powders. Just Few Online powders of the Eco Portion set. So you can get you can get a kilo bag and I think a free kilo bag. Yeah. So I'm sorry. Um... <laughs> What's it called? Yeah. It's just because it's a big bowl. Yeah, really big. Right, I think bowl. we could just tip this in because it's only yeah. a small bag. So, what we're we measuring? Are we doing 300 grams? Yeah. And we'll need how many grams of water? 30. 90. 90. We'll just measure 92 and a half grams. Right. So, now once you, you've got the weight of your powder, reset your scales. Right, and then we're going to pour 90 grams of water in. Yeah. Okay. Right. Get your mitt with your whisk ready. Yeah. Move a minute. Move your whisk. I'll just get it ready just so we can. Is that 90? Yeah. Alright, mix. Hold the, if you hold the bowl, you've got more control. There you go. And then you mix it, mix, mix, mix until everything is mixed in. Right, go through the middle. Right, move to the middle, darling. There you go. Right, go on, mix. It's getting a little harder, but I can do it. You can do it. You're doing amazing there all by yourself. Let me to give it one big stir for you. Right, give it here. That's mummy. We just want to make sure that everything is 
say. Now just make sure everything is mixed together and yeah. there's no lumps because otherwise you, yeah. the lumps will fall down to the bottom. Yeah. You don't want that, do you? Yeah. I didn't know that you caught it. Yeah. Okay. You want to fill it up about a quarter of the way to start with? Yeah. Sorry if you can't see, he's only little. Yeah. You need to stand a bit closer to the table, darling. He is stood on her. He is stood on something. Yeah. Because I'm a little short. And You're not stand... a little short. You're five. I <laughs> know <laughs> what they're doing. He's just tapping out all the bubbles. Yeah. Stop. Now time for the lid. But you've not done your mic powder, so we're just oh, going to yeah. let that. We should have mixed up a little bit less, so you need to hurry up quickly. Go on. You have to be fast, Alicia. Come on, quick, quick. Use that one. Yeah, but use this one. Because okay. if you dip the pink into the purple, you're going to contaminate your... Yeah. Right, so we're back and we just made sure everything was um, covered with the... We need to hurry up to make sure that this is not Alicia. Make sure it's your mold. Yeah. And my channel. So all we're doing is pouring from a height really slowly just to get into all the crevices and then mummy's going to give them a squeeze. Yeah. So we're just squeezing just to make sure that any bubbles within the mould yeah. come out to the surface. Fill it right up to the top. <laughs> you can hear my husky in the garden. Yeah. <laughs> If we can get a little bit tiny bit more in there. Right guys, so this takes 30 minutes to one hour to cure depending yeah. on the room temperature. So we're going to leave it a couple of hours to let it set because the longer you leave it to set, the stronger the, the product becomes. So uh, we will be back later once this is cured so I will get back with you later. Say goodbye Alicia. Hi everybody. We're back. These are now... Secured. They're now cured, so Alessio will start by demolding this one first. So we'll leave that one for last. You want to? So if we keep it there, you can. People can see. It's a little hard. Is it a little hard? Well, mummy will do it yeah. for you then. Okay. There you go. Wow, look at that. I'll do this one, mum. Yeah, just one minute, darling. Right, do you know when you're in the camera, you need to make sure that your moulds are in the in, uh, underneath the camera because otherwise people can't see. Be very gentle with that one. We do have a little bit of bubbles. Yeah, but it's okay. Because we can sand it down, can't we? Right, so if you go round your lip first, yeah. this is called the the lip of the mould. And, and then what that'll do, it'll come away from the seal. We have got quite a few bubbles. It's all right, though, we can sort them. Just one minute. And look at that. It looks amazing. That's beautiful, isn't it? And then that. Goes on top of that. Goes on top of there. So if you do find that you use any of the casting powder compounds, yeah. um, they do need, if you do get any bubbles, you can give them a quick sand down. You can use a nail file or sandpaper. Um, yeah. Make sure you do it wet. Wet sanding is always better because it leaves a smooth finish. Yeah. So um, this is for his sister. So we we leave this to dry for 24 hours. Yep, yeah, then we're going to wax it. And then we're going to... Well, we're not waxing this because we've got the... Bloom finish. Yeah. <laughs> Bloom finish is remembered from last time. So this yeah. is like a glue sealant varnish. So, um, But we won't do that um, on camera because there is videos of him doing that. But what we will do is we'll we'll get that done tonight, uh, well, tomorrow. Um, yeah. And once it's done, we'll upload some photos on this community yeah. tab. Yeah. So that's it for today, guys. Go on. We might see you tomorrow. Yeah, we'll do a video tomorrow if you're feeling... Because yeah. you, you, you pull it at the moment, aren't you? Yeah. He's got a bit of a tummy bug, so... Um, he's, he's, he's not been feeling too great. So, yeah. he, he would like you to please like his videos, comment... And subscribe. And subscribe. And hit the bell button. Hit the bell button so you don't miss any uploads. And we'll see him on tomorrow's video. Yeah. So Bye. goodbye. Say goodbye. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.